Times Square in lovely New York City. It's Caroline's Comedy Hour. 2 p.m. Rehearsal. And it's six hours before showtime as cast and crew of A&E's Caroline's Comedy Hour rehearse the script for tonight's double show taping. A script which will undergo many changes. It's comedy, so what ends up happening all the time is that you have what we call a signed off script, yeah, yeah, yeah. which invariably the moment we walk into the club changes because somebody thinks of something funny again and it starts evolving. Here, host Richard Jenny, supermodel Carol Alt, and comedian Rich Francesi run through a sketch satirizing the game show Jeopardy and modeling. Hands on buzzers. Something you put on your face to look prettier. And Carol. Uh, makeup. You have to phrase it in the form of a question. Uh, makeup? Basically, you, there's no way to know if anything's any good until you see it on its feet. There's constantly uh, a lot of arguing back and forth uh, between everybody about what's funny and what's not. And you, the trouble is you can't prove it. After two hours of rehearsal, the piece is performance ready. And a short break gives us a chance to visit what is appropriately called the writer's bunker at Caroline's. It seems that Caroline's Comedy Hour and perhaps other comedy shows has a prerequisite, and that is that all writers on our show must be somewhat insane. A lot of the writers in comedy for shows like this and many other shows come from the stand-up world. You're not just dealing with writers, you're dealing with comedians. They're a great bunch of guys, and they're the type of people who I'd get together with quite a lot if it wasn't for the fact that I can't stand them. The crowd in Caroline's lobby anticipates entrance to the main stage. The truck makes final preparations. And backstage, performers wait for their seven minutes on stage. Seven minutes, which will feel like seven seconds or seven hours, depending on the audience response. Once we start rolling tape, which is a matter of minutes away. Testing one, two. After weeks of planning, three, show three. number 101 begins, and Richard Jenny tees off on golf. You know what would make golf more exciting? Defense. <laughs> Arnold Palmer is stepping up to the tee. He's got both feet planted firmly. Whoa, Nicholas clubs him in the head with a four-wood. We love Richard. I mean, he's just, he's able to respond quickly, and he's great at the writers' meetings, and, he, and he's got a great stand-up act, and he brings a lot to the show. The Jeopardy sketch gets a lot of laughs. Carol, you still pick. Cosmetics. Hey, getting dangerous. <laughs> This brownish-red powder is brushed on the cheeks for a healthy appearance. Tony. What is a uh, cinnamon? No, no, sir. And after ten comics, two shows, and one duck, Richard Jenny says goodnight. But not without this important advice on the art of delivery. The actual slogan is, it's time well spent, A&E. But it could be, you know, come off very badly if you said A&E is time well spent. Ruined. Gone. So the important way to say it is Caroline's on A&E is time well spent. See the difference?